What's up, guys? Eric, I'm out here with Arma Crate and 6S EXB. Uh, she's kind of in disguise right now with this uh, Proline Brute body. I thought I would try this on here. I had it sitting around. The stock body pretty much bit the dust. Uh, so we're going to uh, give this one a run. I'm going to be uh, testing out some new M2C uh, drive shafts. Uh, this is an outdrive drive shaft, if you guys can see it. Make sure I'm getting it in the camera here. Uh, it's a super beefcake in the center right here, and it tapers down. It's made from a quality uh, tool steel, uh, much, much stronger than stock. Uh, it's the same material that the uh, 8S drive shafts are made from, the M2C drive shafts. So we shouldn't have any trouble with these bending. Um, he's uh, going to make these uh, for the entire 6S line and also the 7th scale, like the Mojave, because uh, we all know that the Mojave drive shafts, especially the front one, likes to bend, especially guys making the um, extended uh, Creighton XL using the Mojave chassis. So a uh, big shout out to a Mitch and every looper for uh, uh, designing a set of awesome drive shafts running the front and the uh, center rear along with the out drives as well in all four corners. So she's fully equipped. I'm running a BLX system in this truck. Uh, it's plenty fast enough as far as I'm concerned running these uh, smaller lightweight uh, LP wheels, the backflip LPs. So uh, everything else on here is M2C, beef as usual. So um, we're gonna give her a quick run and see what's up. Kind of rough out here. That was kind of rough. That's a good drive shaft test. Oh, got caught by an RC trap at the last second. <laughs> uh, these dang RC traps. Didn't quite get that second rotation in. She looks good in there. Drive shaft still looks straight. Oh, Come on, girl. Uh, a little rough out here for her.
Hey guys, that's a tricky run up right there because I keep getting kicked off course with this uh, rough terrain. Alright guys, it's time to haul some butt. I put in the 23 tooth pinion, the uh, Italian belt of guitars. So let's see what's up. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for now. Just wanted to get a good test on these shafts. This thing absolutely flies with these guitars on it. <laughs> it makes it a whole different truck for sure. Uh, but so far, as far as I could tell, everything is uh, still straight as far as the shafts go. Um, all four corners and the centers. I have to roll it and see. I'm not sure if you guys can see, but everything looks uh, looks pretty straight. Uh, uh, one thing with hitting the ramp at high speed like that, a lot of times. The yeah, front shaft right here wants to bend because it takes a lot of brute force off the lip of the ramp, especially at the front of the chassis. And uh, so far that shaft is still perfectly straight as far as I could tell. So uh, again, huge shout out to Mitch and Avery Looper for another awesome upgrade. Uh, to me, this is the icing on the cake. Uh, upgrade for the truck, pretty much. I mean, you've got everything else for it. And uh, that's the last thing she was liking. So a uh, big thanks to uh, Mitch and Avery for their uh, dedication and and uh, getting these things pumped out. But all right guys, had a lot of fun. We'll get out again soon. RC Dude 801, peace out.